Hi, this is Kevin Self from Concentris. I want to show you the quick tip to print ZPL files to the thermal printer. The shipping labeling integration feature enables you to print a barcode shipping label for a sales order, vendor return, or transfer order. If you install the thermal printer driver and have shipping label integration enabled from enabled features, and along with your shipping account setup, you can print labels in ZPL format using a thermal printer. After installing a thermal printer driver, according to the printer manufacturer's instruction, we're going to share the printer on the network. So I have identified uh, my printer by going from the control panel, hardware and sound, devices and printer, and this is my um, printer for GPL, thermal printer. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the right click the mouse and go into the printer properties to um, share the printer on the network. And going to the sharing tab, click the share this printer and uh, enter the, um, the printer name here. And make sure that um, the printer name does not contain any spaces and special characters and try to keep it as simple as possible. I'll keep it as uh, zebra123. Once I hit OK, we'll next step is to send the file, label files to the printer. We're going to create a batch file. So open a text editor such as Notepad. And then type this into your um, Notepad. Since um, I'm printing to a local printer using a USB port, we're going to replace the printer name with the name of our printer in the Zebra123. And we're not going to replace the computer name with our uh, computer because it will change the dynamically when the batch file runs. So after this has been um, typed in, we're going to save as and choose all files and name it as label.bat. And hit save. Now we're going to um, add a file extension and assign default program association. To do that, from the start menu, enter indexing. And then open up the in the indexing. Oops. From the indexing options, click advance, click file types, and type CPL. And we're going to hit add. And as you can see, ZPL has been added. And these steps ensures that um, we can search the ZPL files from the window search. And then we can hit OK and close. Now we're going to set a default program to open a batch file. So from a, a ZPL file that you have, we're going to go with um, open with and make sure that you check the always select the program to open this kind of file and hit browse. And let's find the label.bat file open and hit okay. Now we'll be able to print a shipping label in a ZPL format. To do so, you can go to the transaction, management, and print checks and forms. And click integrate shipping labels. And then you can select print and hit print to print your um, label in ZPL format. I hope you enjoyed this video and helped you to print ZPL files to the thermal printer easier. Thank you for watching this video.